All right, Bob, thanks so much. Moving now to News 2 Crime Tracker Alert. Hendersonville police arresting two men they call serial burglars. The arrest wasn't just by luck. News 2's Andy Cordan has been working on the case. He joins us live now in studio to tell us how it all went down. Andy. Well, Hendersonville police used a crime fighting tactic known as predictive policing. That's where they use stats, crime trends, and they try to make an educated guess when the criminals might strike again. On June 3rd, a two-day stakeout in the Home Depot parking lot pays dividends as Hendersonville police surround a completely surprised Joseph Charette. Police say the 55-year-old getaway truck driver is the accomplice of this man. He's William Brown Jr. Police tell me in just two months, the 49-year-old is caught on video eight times stealing expensive tools from this big box store. But thanks to something called predictive policing, Hendersonville police are in position to crack the case when the duo returns. In this particular case, we were looking at a shoplifting event. We look at the days, the times, the MO that the individual is using. We look at uh, uh, current trends, you know, how they're fencing the property, what they might be doing as far as overcoming security measures at the, at the particular stores. And then we utilize all that to um, make an educated guess on what we can do to try to prevent the stuff in the future. Now, Hendersonville police charged both these men with a dozen crimes, and many cop shops around Middle Tennessee are also looking at them for crimes in those jurisdictions. I'll have more com coming up tonight at 5. For now, back to you.